through Philadelphia at 6-1 Dallas. The Cowboys had won 10 straight at home. In fact, the last loss in the stadium with the hole in the roof was to Philadelphia last September, a year ago. Could the Eagles do it to the Cowboys again? Well, Randall Cunningham trying to get the offense going, but in the first quarter, Larry Brown, the great coach at Kansas, now quarterback for the Dallas Cowboys, makes the interception. And a 30-yard return has the Cowboys in business. Randall trying to scramble. He's nailed by Larry Brown. Then, Randall runs into old friend Jim Jeffcoat, or vice versa, I should say. And Jeff Coat the Cowboys front wall doing a job. Yeah, here's a team rush. Uh, Thomas Everett, number 31, from the left. Charles Haley from the right. Clearing away for Jim Jeff Coat right up the middle of the field for the sack. First half, Tom and the Eagles had two yards passing, but they trail only 3 0. And with Randall struggling, Rich Coat tight gambles and goes with Jim McMahon, who rallies him right away to Fred's Barnett for 14 yards. Two plays later, McMahon. To Calvin Williams. Nice catch for a 37 yard pickup after a penalty. McMahon, not Randall, I said McMahon. Scrambling. Jimmy Mack, why don't you hurry back for an 11 yard gain? Two plays later, look at the tread on that tire. Herschel Walker, touchdown, 7 to 3 Eagles. Randall out to congratulate that masked man, Jim McMahon. Troy Aikman, 0-6 as a starter, lifetime against Philadelphia. Looks good to Michael Irvin, 21-yard pickup. Next play, Aikman, zip, the tight end, Jay Novacek, down to the Eagle, 35. Just three plays later. Aikman to Kelvin Martin, down to the 22. Aikman, Martin, makes the spin, makes the spin, makes the dash, gets in the end zone, 10-7 Cowboys. The Eagles punt Dallas at their own 14. And Byron Evans picks off Aikman. Shades of that Monday night game when Aikman was picked up three times. It's out of the 13. First and goal on the four. Herschel, is he in? No, says the referee. And Chris, I thought this was a horrible call by the referee. You either got a touchdown or a fumble. I don't think the play could have been called dead. And you watch Herschel Walker's presence of mind there. Held the ball over the plane at the goal line. It should have been a touchdown. But it's no touchdown. So on second down, Herschel tries it again. No, sir. Tony Casillas with the hit. Third down, McMahon. Incomplete to Herschel. Jimmy Johnson's defense hold. Who framed Roger Ruzek kicks a field goal. We're tied at 10. Cowboys get the ball back. Emmett Smith, last five games against Philadelphia. Rush for 60 yards. This is 51 yards on one play in itself. And he goes over 100 yards. The first guy to go over 100 yards against Philly in the regular season. Since Gerald Riggs in 1989, 54 games. But Emmett doesn't stop there. Field goal gives him a 13-10 lead. And now we're going to run out the clock with Emmett. Oh, Emmett, you're unbelievable. Look at him just to balance and pick up 11 more yards. Beating the Eagles to the corner for another first down. Emmett Smith, unbelievable game. 30 carries, 163 yards, 20 to 10 Dallas. McMahon is picked off by Isaac Holt who made a couple of foolish plays earlier in the game. And for the first time in Jimmy Johnson's reign as Cowboys coach, the Cowboys beat the Eagles at home. They win it 20 to 10. Emmett Smith with 163 yards rushing. 11 straight wins for the Cowboys over the Eagles at home. They're on a roll and have a two game lead over the Eagles in the standings. The Skins game, of course, Sunday night. Dallas at seven and one, an impressive win.